This is KNEB.TV Ag News from the FNBO Ag Desk. FNBO, the great big small bank. Cattle producers may be looking at some tough decisions in the next few weeks as our dry weather holds on. Aaron Berger, Nebraska Extension Beef Educator, says the mild winter gave producers an opportunity to graze crop residue. Uh, the negative with that is, of course, is that uh, we had some dry conditions last year, and so hay yields were less, uh, certainly, on some of our dry land hay. And so we are we didn't have a lot of hay going into the winter, so I think there's not going to be much carryover. And then also with that, uh, there's just been quite a bit of hay demand. I guess as we end the spring, I don't see a lot of carryover hay out there. With the dry conditions, there is the question of whether or not the rangelands are ready for the cattle. We've had a very dry winter, and anyone who's dug post holes or anything like that knows we just don't really have any moisture in a profile. And so really the next two months are pretty critical for us here in the panhandle in terms of grass growth. And the challenge with that is we have to have a significant amount of moisture now even to wet up soils enough to uh, get grass started. Berger says now is the time to make your drought plan and even delay turning out the cattle. And then whatever precip we do get, we capture and hopefully hold um, with having more growth out there. So also think about what classes of cattle can you plan on either marketing or dry lotting to uh, reduce stocking rates on range and pasture. Berger says if producers are looking at dry lotting or other options, they are welcome to give him a call at 308-325-3122.